What's up guys? Today, we're going to do an in-depth review of True Notion's Olive Trunk. Got here. Yep, I'm just take in, look at the, yeah, it's really soft. So, before I try this on and let you guys see how it looks like, um, I haven't worn it yet, um, but I really like the material that I've used on the um, band. But I'm not sure how it will hold up in the long run because I can sort of see like on the back there is the seam and it looks a bit stretched like when you pull it. Um, I'm not sure whether or not like the band. The band is really soft and it's got a, a sheen finish to it but what else? Yeah, and it's it's about like slightly more than an inch wide, um, so I think it should hold a lot of um, uh, should hold up throughout the day. I'm not sure my fat stomach might like actually it folded down. I I, I don't know. Um, the material also it's really soft. Um, it doesn't feel like microfiber itself. Let's just see. Yep, it's. 5% spandex and 95% polyester so mm -hmm. um, what I like about this is there's not a lot of seams um, sewn on uh, apart from the reinforcement pouch here you can see it there are no seams anywhere else yeah, down there. but everywhere else it's just sort of a smooth like and, and I think that's really important for a lot of like comfortable underwears to not just have too many seams. Like, I know some brands they have on the side, uh, the front reinforcement pouch, and then like down the middle of your butt crack, all the way down to the uh, where it meets the reinforcement pouch. I think that gets really itchy, and sometimes they just kind of stuck up the butt. So anyway, let's go try this on. Very big thighs. Well, I think they're okay size. Um, they're not very muscular. Um, so there's these little things here that um, yeah, so sort of pulls it in place. I'm not really used to wearing a trunk. I usually wear a bit longer um, because what I notice is a lot of trunks they sort of ride up throughout the day. Um, I'm gonna see how it stacks up throughout the day and I'll let you know when I come back from work tonight. Um, yeah, it feels really nice. Yeah, the, the bands are just nice. It's it's a low rise, so there's no like having to pull it all up and like access hanging from the middle. Um, stretch wide. Yeah, it feels good. And the, the bands here, you can see the bands here still sort of hold it all into place, so that's good. Um, yeah, and like I said, like you know how important it is to not to have so many stitches on and seams on the underwear. Um, this feels really good. Uh, so for guys, I think that's more than enough space for your little Joey. And um, for the other trans guys out there, um, there isn't a two layer where you can pack and pack it in the front. Uh, you probably would have to uh, if you if you you pride pride over comfort. Um, this in general is very comfortable. Oh man, the lighting just went down. Uh, yeah, this is comfortable, but there isn't a two little pouch thing where you could pack uh, in the front. You might probably just have to put it on the inside, or you could buy a. A pack a pouch and just put it on the inside of your underwear um, whichever um, but I I'm fine with with whatever and I think it looks okay what do you think yep in terms of like you know if you're wearing this to the gym and stuff I think this would hold up oh I do see it braiding up a little bit but not significantly just fold it 
on its own. Um, but yeah, overall, in terms of like comfort at the moment, I would give it a. I'll give it a 8 for 5 and we'll see how I feel at the end of the day. Thanks guys. Hey guys, um, so it's the end of the day and let's just talk about the underwear itself. So um, let's see. Okay, it's not too bad. Um, but Comfort wise, it's it's really comfortable and I actually forgot that I was wearing underwear throughout the day because uh, the material feels very much like my really soft um, pair of jeans that I have on here right now from, um, is it from? I think that's from Roger David, I'm not sure, in Australia. So it's, it's really soft, it's really stretchy. <laughs> um, yeah, so the underwear was really comfortable also. The only thing that reminded me that I was wearing underwear was the riding up of the leg holes. Um, granted, the the riding up was, uh, isn't as bad as a lot of underwears that I've tried on before. Um, it's actually pretty, like even if it rides up, it sits comfortably, like you know, just tucked in there. Um, whereas a lot of other ones bunches up, this one doesn't really bunch up. Maybe because it's on a shorter length already but also the leg se seams are not very thick they're less than a cm each mm, like maybe like okay let's see maybe 0.5 of a cm so the writing up didn't really um bother me as much um what bothered me was i kept feeling like because maybe because i felt like i wasn't wearing underwear um i kept feeling and having to check like oh um like why is it you know um, not holding in place uh, around the waistband but it actually is um, it sits comfortably uh, it sits a lot lower than most underwears uh, would so yeah um, for those who uh, trans guys who like to tuck in their binders into the underwear so it doesn't ride up this one doesn't really hold as much it doesn't hold it down uh, it moves around a little bit, maybe because of the the shiny uh, finish on the waistband itself. Uh, I took some video, uh, short videos of like close-ups of the underwear, so you guys could take a look at, at it a little bit better. Um, so that's it. That's it for True Notions um, Olive Trunk, uh, and I will see you next time with another pair of underwear.